Hey guys, Crew Blowing Way back. I'm Aaron. Ah! Stop it! That was a delay. And we're back with Brooklyn Nine Nine. Yes, previously uh, we had an episode involving internet game nights and coming out to your parents. Machete. I've done two of those things. Yes, and uh, last time we had all those things happen, so. We did. What's it going to be? And Gina's return! Yes, Gina has returned. She's back. She was going to be gone. Decided not to. And was getting a raise and working on her side business. I don't know. But she decided. He plays game nights. Thank you, Margaret. You're welcome, Raymond. Seamus <sighs> Murphy. That's right. Remember how I saved your detectives from prison in exchange for a favor? Time has come. Wait, this is in my order. What? This is an omelet. I only eat omelets on vacation. Yeah, I don't care what you eat. I'm here to call in the favor that you owe me. <laughs> Billy, what if I say no? This is you asking me for intel and promising to pay me back. How do you think this would look to your boss, especially now that you're up for the commissioner job? Gotcha. Yeah, I know everything. So, what do you want from me? A permit to throw a block party? We don't even have to break the law. This is fantastic news. I am not giving Seamus Murphy that permit. He only wants to use the block party as a cover for something criminal, a robbery, a murder, or something worse. You don't know that for sure. And that's your loophole. I don't believe in loopholes. What? Loopholes are the best. Remember that time when Pancake Palace had that all-you-can-eat deal, but they didn't set a time limit? I ate pancakes for a week for $3.99. All I had to do was sleep there and never shower. What? Thanks for the invite, friend. I will not be using a loophole, Peralta. As always, I'll be using the main hole or no hole. I choose no hole. You just said hole way too much, sir. And that's coming from Charles. Yes, that's <laughs> concerning. Uh, think you know someone, Jake? Unbelievable! <laughs> he feels betrayed about that pancake. Unbelievable! Thing. Captain, we think we found a way for you to do Murphy the favor and still live with yourself. Sounds like a loophole. Nope, we found the main hole, and it is open for business. Oh, gross. Yep. <laughs> Why is he gross now? The Godfather. The Diane Keaton movie. No one refers to it as that, but Charles is right, she is. Diane Keaton. This isn't Keaton. one of your movie plans, is it? First of all, if we had developed a Minority Report-style pre-crime division like I suggested, we wouldn't be in this shameless mess. And it's not just because I wanted to go like this, although I did. But secondly, <laughs> in The Godfather, Don Corleone had three sons. Michael, his favorite. Diane Keaton's husband. Okay, then there was Sonny, the hothead. Diane Keaton's brother-in-law. Charles. Diane Keaton's in The Godfather? <laughs> Continue going through Diane Keaton's relatives. Fine. Diane Keaton's other brother-in-law is Fredo, the screw-up, the weak link. And you think the Murphys have a Fredo? Every family does. And in this family, his name is Kyle. Is he on the road? <laughs> yes, it's his driver's license photo somehow. All right, go make contact with Diane Keaton's brother-in-law. Fredo. It's Fredo. It's one of the most popular movies of all time. One best picture. So. Never seen it. It's a damn Ready shame. I need a private place where I could pump. I was thinking maybe I could take this whole floor and you guys could move down to that place where we park. The garage? Sure, if you think that works. Well, there's an empty office behind records. It's nice and quiet. We can put in a comfy chair, maybe a mini fridge. Uh, that would be a no-go, Sarge. That's our nap room. She needs to pump. The room is hers. Whoa, that escalated fast. Mm -hmm. Their nap room? Nap room. Yes. Every room is their nap room. Change the channel, dude. Finding Bigfoot is starting. <laughs> we are small time operators that just moved here from Miami. We piloted go fast boats moving contraband to Cuba. Well, we slept with the same prostitute. No. And she said you were the best she ever had. Maybe. And I should watch you to learn. Back to no. What's this? <laughs> we love finding Bigfoot. It's our favorite show. Yeah. I mean, why haven't they caught him yet, right? Totally. I mean, he's so big, you'd think it'd be easy. Yeah. I'm feeling a real connection here. Should we hang out sometime, or am I being crazy? You're not being crazy, Kyle. How do you know my name? Because we're so connected. Oh, yes! What? <laughs> oh, my gosh. Uh, they lucked up. I accidentally ordered 100 lamps instead of one. It only give you, like, a six-month return window, so. <laughs> You get it. Totally. Six months? What? Got into town for Miami. Where we didn't sleep with the same prostitute. Yes. <laughs> Why do you need to say that? Apparently I'm a liability and worthless. And Kyle. The last one is just my name, but you should hear their tone. So, oh, I feel bad know, for Kyle. Uh, if you know anyone who's looking to buy a lamp for really cheap, I know a guy. Oh, Kyle. Yeah, that's it. That's how they say it. <laughs> <laughs> It all fits together, and when the puzzle is solved and you take a step back and see the big picture, it's like staring into the face of God. Hey, 
You moved up a spot. Oh, you seem like a real nerd. <laughs> <laughs> to get an approved 1290, I need an approved 1021J, which I can't get without an approved 1290, which I can't get without an approved 1021J, which I can't get without an approved 1290, which I can't get without an approved 1021J, which I can't get without an approved 1290, which I can't get without an approved 1021J, which okay. I can't get without an approved 1290J. She's in a loop. You broke her brain. I'm gonna take her out of here. 1021J, which I can't get without an approved 1290, which I can't get without. Sorry. <laughs> Man, she just kept going. That was good. There's no way she needs to be pumping more than 20 minutes a side. Wow. You didn't even say breast. Yeah, because I'm not a child. I need my afternoon nap. <laughs> Where's Gina? She just left the pump running and disappeared. You got played so hard. You cock. He said that a couple times now. <laughs> Dang. Okay, put in my password. Yes, it's in the impound lot. My brain. What was his password? Did he try multiple times? Florence Tinge. She ran the rules and regs department for thirty years. She wrote the forms. Haven't you ever filled out a mileage reimbursement form? No, dude. I make you do those for me. Right. I'm so grateful to you for that. Anyway, she's the only person that can figure this out. She understands the bureaucracy on a level that we mortals can't even fathom. Florence Tinge. What? <laughs> Detective Ziaz in Santiago, NYPD. And I just want to say, those cats are having sex. Yeah. Uh, can you explain these forms yeah. to us? They seem logically flawed. At first I thought it was a mistake, but then I thought there's something deeper at play here. No, it's a mistake. They don't work. What? But you wouldn't design a form that literally can't be filed. Yeah, I would. I did it all the time. Mostly out of spite, but also incompetence. Plus, I just found out I'm dyslexic. Okay, thank you for your time. Good luck with all your uh, hoarding, Florence. Wow. We're supposed to pick up Kyle in a minute. We can't just bring him straight to his uncle's rolls or it'll seem suspicious. So we gotta figure out a way to make him notice it on his own. What if you drive by and I yell, those two birds are having sex? He'll obviously want to see that. And when he looks, voila, the car's right there. Or I could just drive by it very slowly. Ah, also a good plan. Okay, let's do it. So that's when it hits me, savory dinner cereal. <laughs> Oh my god. What? Instead of it being cold, what if I heat it up? Unless, is that just soup? <sighs> it is. You know what? I think I left my wallet at home. I'm just gonna turn around. Dude, look! My favorite gamer just uploaded a new vid, and his mom is in this one. <laughs> then Tom Cruise hang glides in with a machine gun, and he's like, this is my party now. <laughs> anyway, if I could make a movie, that's how it would start. Kyle, look! Two birds are having sex. What? Where? Oh man, I missed it. Well, let's just turn around again. Where are those birds? Still no humping birds, damn it. We're never gonna see those birds. Look behind that 1980 white Rolls Royce. Oh, I wish this stupid car would move. Kyle, isn't that your uncle's car? Oh my God. Dude, <laughs> I did it. I found it, I found my uncle's car. <laughs> Victory dance, woo! Oh no, wait, stop, don't dance in the... Oh, Fredo. <sighs> I think I got hit. <laughs> I think I got hit. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Corey Barefoot. I'm violating Uniform Conduct Code 773 because the rules are pointless, because they are written by a hoarder who doesn't care. Same here. Fight the power. We can't even do Fight the power. So you ready for a kick ass assignment? Kick ass. Hell yeah. That's a big bullshit. Pretty cool. And a ruler in her socks. It was like it the is. revert, it was like opposite of yeah. Rosa, but. Much nerdy. We have a huge surprise for you. You found my birth mother? What? No. <laughs> the surprise isn't gonna be as good as that. I'm sorry I let you guess. <laughs> Remember the other day at the bar when we first met? I was all alone and having some pretty dark thoughts. Really? Yeah. I was ready to just uh, give up. Oh no, Kyle. On my rap career. Oh, that's somewhere different than I thought. I'm glad that you kept rapping. Thanks. You're the two best dudes I've ever known. That's nice. And hey. Guess what? You did find my birth mother. No, nope. I was gonna say you're a great guy too, but I'm sorry I keep teeing that up. But you're looking for her. Sure. He's just so happy. He's so... Yeah. This one was never officially decertified. Which means it's still valid, which means you have to process it. Street closure request for the public humiliation of loose women. And as you can see, you are required to expedite processing for the fee of one hay penny. Keep the change. Okay. But it says here that the form must, must be submitted by a man. I know, it's a huge bummer. But also, 
Hi there. I'd like to humiliate some hussies, and I'm in a hurry. <laughs> yeah, I'm in a hurry. I like to humiliate hussies. Pumping hard or hardly pumping, Gina? Where were you? Uh, just so we're on the same page. How long have you been here? I.e., how elaborate does my lag need to be? An hour. Okay, the CIA contacted me, and there's some... Gina, you cannot use pumping as an excuse to slack off. I wasn't slacking off. Well, you weren't here. Man, I was trying to help you. <sighs> I know, I'm sorry. I went home. I was missing Iggy, and I wanted to see her. Oh. Well, you could have just told me. Yeah, but I was embarrassed. Juggling things is hard. I feel like a failure. I feel like a coulier. No, you're not a coulier, Gina. Look, being a working parent is hard. When my twins were born, I made Sharon keep the phone on all day just so I could listen to them. One month, I used 25,000 minutes. I'm sorry. I just realized I told you it sucks and there's no solution. Oh, that's okay. It's kind of nice to hear this kind of thing from another parent. So, thank you. You know, I don't even think Dave Coulier juggles. I Googled it. He doesn't. What a trip. <laughs> that spitting rhymes, kissing shorties on the lips. Have no fear, Mr. Rap is here and he will drink three beers. I wish I would turn the radio down. You think that's the radio? That sounds like <laughs> professional music to you? All music after Mahler sounds exactly like that. <laughs> would you turn the radio down? Oops. What was that? He broke the bottle. He freed of it. Oh, so you didn't plan for everything. You forgot to idiot-proof the bottle. Well, perhaps you want to idiot-proof your criticism because I got him a backup bottle with a backup bug. Good thing I had another one. Oh, no. God. And there goes the backup bottle. Right, except for one thing. Please. I also put a bug in the keys. Oh, oh of course you did. Guy's got more bugs up his sleeve than Oogie Boogie. Don't get the reference. Nightmare Before Christmas. Yeah, that's a good one. They're talking. Hey, Uncle Seamus. These are for you. You found my roles. <laughs> I'm impressed. Hey, welcome back to the family, huh? We got a lot of catching up to do. Well done. Well done. Thank you both. We did it. We reunited a family. Is this what it feels like to be Oprah? <laughs> you wish. What's the plan? Hey, there's nothing in here. That truck is as empty as Jackson Brown's running surface. Empty? Running on empty? He sings that song. Running service? Okay, so Terry didn't like it. Charles? Don't make me do this, Jake. <laughs> Whatever. The point is, the truck is empty. So we did it. I can't believe it's all wrapped up. Do you even know what we did? No, just feeling out how close we were to calling it a day. Soon, Scully. Now the captain <laughs> hold has repaid his debt without compromising his stupid moral compass, the only thing left is for him to get his tape back, which should be happening right about a now. Oh, your block party's going well. Wasn't as much fun as I hoped it would be, but uh, you lived up to your end of the park, so I'm a man of my word. As am I. Your tape? You ever want to do business again, my door is always open. Well, you should close it, lest you get moths today. <laughs> <laughs> lest you get moths. No, what's wrong? Why do you always assume something's wrong when I come in here? Couldn't I be bringing you good news? Are you? No, something's terribly wrong. It's Janus. What do you mean? Forensics confirm the tape you made of me was never copied. We're in the clear. It's not about that. I was checking our bug, and I overheard him talking about what went wrong with the armored car heist. He's pinning the blame on... Kyle! It has to be him. Everything was going great until he suddenly reappeared out of the blue. But that dum-dum ran his mouth. And that is the last time he screws over this family. He's gonna pay. Did he say what he would do to him? No, they ran over a huge pothole and then complained about de Blasio for the next hour. Yes, he needs to do something about the roads. Look, I don't specifically know <laughs> they're gonna do something bad to Kyle. They might just lightly beat him up, so we could do nothing. We could take the loophole. You do love loopholes. I know we just put Seamus behind us, but unfortunately, you've made me a better person. Yeah, you like Kyle. I think we have to help Kyle. Good. I'm proud of you. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, I just... Said you're proud of me, that's my tear trigger. All right, let's go save Kyle before the dam breaks. <laughs> All right. Hello, Seamus. Hello, Raymond. So apparently NYPD police came today to arrest my nephew Kyle for unpaid parking violations. And you want me to, what, clear his record? I've already done my favor. No, I know it's a cover. I know he's in protective custody because he helped you stop my armored car play. I don't know what you're talking about. You asked me for a permit, and I got it. I paid my debt. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a bowl of mush to enjoy. You're right. Oh, it's mush? But I owe you. 
And what exactly does that mean? That means you mess with my family, I mess with yours. You tell your husband, Kevin. I'll see him real soon. What? Remulon. Remulon. Thank God they have cheddar to protect them. <sighs> that dog. I was like, man, they wrapped up this uh, blackmail storyline yeah, quickly, so. but no, we, uh, we've ramped it up now. Indeed. Poor Kyle. I yeah. know the way he is. He was... He so, can. Nah, he, he just... <laughs> I don't know if he can. Rick. He's got a heart of gold. I don't know if he can. I have to believe that some people, people can better themselves. That man <laughs> bought a hundred lamps instead of one on an accident and hey, couldn't return them because hey, they only had a six-month return policy. Remember we were trying to buy these chairs? Policy. And we kept trying to buy the chairs. And we! <laughs> but we! Hey, yeah, I guess one, that was, that was all Calvin. <laughs> <laughs> Two, it was like, you know, cards can only go whatever it is uh-huh. kind of thing. And it's like, well, let's do this. Well, I think it went through. Maybe it went through. Did it not go through? Here's five orders. We were getting 20 chairs. I, I definitely, I can't remember what it was at the college, but I did buy something that I thought I was buying things, and I was buying boxes of things. Mm. But I returned them. Yeah. Jancy bought something one time, and they just sent her a box of things, but she got it for the price of the one thing. Nice. I can't remember what it was, though. An iPad. Yeah, that did happen, too. And he's like, send her an iPad. And she's like, I don't want to do with this. And her dad's like, I'll take it. She says, you sent it to him. I wanted to see... Hmm? I had to do some math, so you guys can keep talking while I do this math real quick. All right. Well, Rick, The Godfather is a fantastic movie it that is Aaron cannot talk about. Incredibly good. It's a good two movies, as a matter of you fact. You like part three? I mean, it's not terrible. I never experienced The Godfather without part three. Like, I just was able to watch one, two, and three. Sure. Immediately. So it didn't really bother me. It was all part of, like, one story. Yeah. I don't know. Makes sense. Hmm. hmm. I was curious. Roughly, I think there's about 43,000 minutes in a month, give or take. So he talked for like half a month on the phone. I was curious on oh, Terry. Terry. Terry said that he left the phone on when he had his kids. And it had sure. a 25,000 bill in a month. Or 25,000 minutes in a month. Well, he's a, I was like, how many minutes are in a month? He's at work eight hours a day. So she just has the phone there like a baby monitor. And he can just listen while he's working. I suppose. And we know there was a big chunk of time after they were born where he was on the desk for a while a long time right true yeah he went to desk work yeah he was afraid after his shooting incident ah! the mannequin. <laughs> yeah i remember that i forgot yep it's a lot of minutes yeah i was just wondering like man half a month I remember minutes uh what? Ha- having a limit of minutes for your cell phone oh um yeah like being concerned that they're gonna roll over but now that. it's more about data yeah Right? How, many, how much data do I have? Is that unlimited data? Is that unlimited data? Yeah. How long until they sure. throttle me? Which I have been grandfathered in on some type of unlimited plan. It's never changed it. I still have the same rate I had many, many, many years ago. You can do that as long as you usually put a phone onto the plan and yeah. not buy a new phone. Because when you yeah. buy a new phone, you got to update your plans usually. But if you just can, if you can get a phone and swap it, yeah, then you usually can stay on the same one. Usually. Like the plan that I'm on, I also have, it's called a Jetpack, which is just like... A mobile data. It's it's a phone. It's everything but the phone, pretty much. Um, it's like a and I was going to like, well, should I upgrade my plan to not have this? But to upgrade on the plan that I'm currently on, to upgrade to not have it would be more more expensive. Yep. So I just still have that, even though I've lost that. I since lost that thing a long time ago. Hmm. Bureaucracy. Yeah. Paperwork. Yeah. Forms. Just we'll never touch it again. All of it sometimes doesn't make sense. <sighs> That's why I was so concerned when I got my new phone and was trying to figure out how to do it. I did not want to go to Verizon. I didn't want to be like, oh, hold on, wait, on a minute, wait on a minute, look at this. We can't have this happen. I can't go there. What was it? I'm in a hurry to see some, to, to what, make fun of some hussies. What, what, what did he say? Yeah, he said uh, humiliate, humiliate some hussies. Humiliate some hussies. And I'm in a hurry. Yeah, there's some like old form that allows you to have some sort of public yep. shaming only being fulfilled by a man. It's like slapping your wife on the courthouse steps on Sundays. Is that Columbus? Is West or is that West Virginia? Yeah. It's Charleston, I think. Yeah. Maybe. It's either Columbus or Charleston. It was like a the courthouse capital. Yeah. yeah. If you took me to the steps of the courthouse capital, you could slap your wife. I don't know why. 
as like, as like a leave a bad this week, week, you know, or what it was. I don't know leave what it away. was. But it also had to be a wife. Mm-hmm. Could be your girlfriend, could be your fiance, your mistress. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's terrible. But I feel like if you force people to slap people in public, yeah. they won't go as hard as if there's no one watching. Maybe. Sunday. I mean, I'd rather there be no slapping whatsoever. Yeah. Suppose. But, like, if there's societal... If society's watching, maybe you don't go as far as you otherwise might. I don't know. Maybe that's, like, the logic behind know. it. It's like... Yeah, maybe. Like, if it's gonna get sold, we might as well tax it. You would think. <laughs> hmm. <sighs> I didn't know where you were gonna go with that. And that makes sense. I mean, it doesn't, but it does. <laughs> but when you said... When you were teeing up that, like, I hate it, but... I was like, what did Maggie do? <laughs> <laughs> I've read a lot of rule books in my time. Yeah, sure. A lot of weird ones. Which I completely believe any sort of like government forms or rules were written by people either for spite mm-hmm. or incompetence. Yeah. And like it just never got changed. Sure. Like, well, most, it's, most rules are done that way. I think also a third one can be like, this will benefit me in a way. Sure. You know, like I will benefit if this is the process that has to be done, or I am the loophole to let me be able to do this, but it's going to be a hindrance for other people or whatever. Wait, laws that are made to benefit a certain individual or class of people? Does that sound ridiculous? Ridiculous. Every month I have to pay taxes to the state of Ohio. It is such a process, and then every month they send me money back because they gave me the wrong number to pay them. How much do they send back? It's like two bucks sometimes. <laughs> it's a check for two dollars. Which then I have to deposit. <laughs> it is a cruel hell. It is a cruel. After they said pay us this much money? Yes, they told me how much to pay. I pay exactly that much. They send me a refund check. Every month. They could hey, just keep it and take it off I, the bill next month. They could. I like that compared to normal taxes when they're just like, hey, you owe us money. I'm like, all right, how much? It's like, you figure it out. If you get it wrong, I'm putting you in jail. Yeah. Fuck. And if you pay too much, we'll keep it. We just got a check back from the IRS. That had no explanation as to why we were getting it. Did we overpay? Yep. What was this for? Yep. I don't know. Money. And it's dealing with that in that we can't do more in our schedule than we currently are. Uh, I liked Kyle. Yes. I kind of was hoping towards the end they were going to be like, by the way, we found your birth mother or something, but they didn't. No. <laughs> Maybe later. Maybe. Cool. I suppose so. Kyle could still be part of this. I want to hear more of his rap. Yeah, I love that whole thing. Like, Wish you would turn down the radio. <laughs> <laughs> like, that sounds awful. It didn't even rhyme, did it? No, it there was no rhyme. <laughs> like, I, was in, I was in a really dark place. I was yeah. about to give up on my raps. <laughs> what was Jake's password? <clears throat> do you think that was unbroken? Like he had this ro- Was do that the limit? password, or was it? Damn. Usually, has an upper limit. What's the upper limit? I mean, it depends on the system. Yeah, sure. Usually, two hundred fifty-six characters. He might have filled in all those. I never thought about like doing that. Really long one. I mean, that's your best bet for not getting it cracked. Like you could just this is my password, and no one will guess it. Like but, uh, General Kenobi, years ago, you served my funds to all of his speech. <laughs> yeah, like, I like the password is the biggest thing for yeah. whether or not it's crackable. Mm. Interesting. Just think of a sentence. This is my sentence I'm always going to use. Mm-hmm. You know? The sky is not blue. The goddamn pen is blue! Oh, you know, funny. I don't know, whatever. <laughs> exclaim, exclaim. <laughs> yeah, you need like a weird three rings for Elven Kings Under the Sky, seven for Dwarf Lords and Halls of Stone. Nine ranks for mortal men doomed to die. One for the Dark Lord and his Dark Throne in a land of mortar where shadows lie. 69. Just don't have a typo. Yeah, it's true. Because then you're like, fuck, where'd I put it? Where'd I mess up? <laughs> Do they have to get permits for, like, the corn festival? Yeah. Which doesn't exist anymore? If you're using a park or a street. When we were doing the pit, we got a permit for the pit. We got so a permit. Like, you, you leave. Yep. Because that way we, we, could, park. we could tell people to leave if, uh, if there was Cops a problem. Cops would show up and be like, we've got a permit, baby. Yeah, we've got a permit. <laughs> Actually, in what? all the times that we've done stuff where cops have shown up, and they've always been like, all right, just hurry up and get out of here or something. I don't. Did the cops ever show up at the skate park? We were there like yes. four nights in a row. One night we didn't have a permit. But yeah. we'd already been there. No one, yeah. no one came. <laughs> we had a permit. I can think of, out of all the times we've ever filmed, yeah. twice we've had a permit. Gotcha. Once was at the skate park when we did the pit. Yep. The second one was for that bank robbery. Guys, thank you so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed this. Make sure you subscribe. 
as we have a new episode of Brooklyn Nine-Nine coming out every week, as well as tons of stuff every day of the week right here. And if you want to see more right now, the next four episodes available are patreon.com slash blindwave. Links in the description below. There's a hole there towards the end. You got low. Low.